St. George's Church in the village of Gorsko Slivovo. An old memory of the past of the village of Gorsko Slivovo refers to the consecrated ground named after Saints Constantine and Helena. It used to be situated in the Mugilata area, south of the present temple. There were priests in the village many years before the Crimean War. In 1852, on Ganchu Bobev's initiative, the construction of the first local church was launched. It was called St. George the Victor and was consecrated by a Greek bishop the following year. Right after the national liberation, the construction of a new church began. It is larger and its belfry is taller. It was completed in 1880 by master builders from Trjavna and was consecrated by Metropolitan Clement of Ternovo in 1881. Over a century later, its roof is covered in vegetation. There is a plate on the facade with an instruction engraved in the stone. It's an expression of the gratitude of local people to the grantor. Images in the temple have been specially arranged in accordance with the symbolism of its parts. The dome symbolizes the sky. That's why Christ Pentecrator and the Holy Trinity have been depicted on it. The raised part of the sacred altar contains the image of the Virgin Mother and the altar displays scenes of the sacred liturgy. The iconostasis situated between the sacred altar and the central part of the temple is not so much a screen as a representation of heaven. The icons are arranged in a canonical order, with the Holy Cross inevitably in the middle, at the top. In the temple of Gorsku Slivovu, a mural of Bulgarian enlighteners Saint Kirill and Methodius can be found too. One of the earliest depictions of the two brothers by a Bulgarian painter can be seen at the church in the village of Debersko. They were supposedly painted at the beginning of the 17th century. To Cyril the, Philo to Cyril the philosopher, who translated the Holy Scripture from Greek to Bulgarian and enlightened the Bulgarian people as the new Second Apostle during the reign of Michael and Orthodox Queen Theodora, his mother, who provided the Holy Church with sacred icons and affirmed Orthodoxy. May his memory live forever. To his brother Methodius, Archbishop of Panonic Moravia, for his efforts over the Slavic Book too. May his memory live forever. The decoration of the Gorsku Slivovu temple was made by master painters of the Deborsku school. The church's patron, Saint George the Victor, is one of the most popular saints of Eastern Orthodoxy. He is always depicted on icons mounted on a horse with the slain dragon at his feet. The presence of the cross, one of the most important symbols since early Christian times, is also very prominent. It is depicted everywhere on the walls, on the ceiling, on the sacred objects and priestly garments, but never on the floor. It was bright, peaceful and quiet in the temple. Outside in the churchyard, with its marigolds in blossom, the calm timelessness of rural life can be sensed.